Hello! Today I'm going to be doing a Lush haul video. I got two packages in the mail today and so now I'm going to turn the camera around and we can see what's in the packages. So these are what was in the two packages. We've got some demon in the shower shower gels from the Lush kitchen made last week and I was able to buy six of them and I'm thinking one's going to be given away on a giveaway I'm going to be having shortly on my blog and so now I'm going to smell this to see if it smells as I remember oh it's so good it smells just like the demon in the dark shower gel um, the one that I had that I showed a couple of weeks ago it smells just like it which is good it smells minty and sort of kind of bracing a tiny tiny bit fruity and you can smell the clove in here now clove seems to be like a love it or hate it kind of a, a, a note and clove is a spice it's a very spicy strong kind of uh, scent it's that really sort of bracing mint and then that sort of spicy little um, clove bud oil in the middle there and so it gives it that kind of spicy mint kind of a <laughs> demon in the dark kind of scent I don't know if I'm making sense but it it gives it a spicy mint scent I smell the mint primarily and then that sort of sweet spicy kick in the middle so it's minty with a spicy kick I think the scent combination is really nice so peppermint infusion is its first ingredient and then we have fresh apple juice fine sea salt spearmint oil peppermint oil clove bud oil and almond oil and this is suitable for vegans this was made by Marius on August 17th, 2016, and it's best used by October 17th of 2017. It says, how to use, get in the shower, unleash the demon in the bottle, and lather all over for a devilishly good claim. Peppermint oil leaves skin soothed, while fresh apple juice leaves you refreshed, and spearmint oil gives a sharp wake-up call reviving your tired mind it says full of apple bobbing goodness just don't be tempted to take a bite so demon in the dark mint and apple it's very minty and it's a gorgeous color as you can see so as far as comparing it to other minty lush products just to get an idea um, it's mintier and spicier than the intergalactic minty bath bomb it's um, it's mintier and spicier than the outback mate new uh, mint soap it's about as minty as the mask of magna minty that lush sell in the stores except it adds some spice to all that mint. The smell of it matches the name, if, if you know what I mean, like because it has this sort of blasting mint and then it's got this sort of spicy clove bud oil that goes like spicy. Like, a, like some kind of demon. Wow. Um, then it's got that shot of apple juice goodness in there too to balance it all out. Lush used to sell a bubble bar that I liked it called Marathon Bubble Bar and that kind of reminds me of this a little bit. It had clove and mint as well but this uh, adds the apple juice to it and then Lush also makes a massage bar that I think they still sell in the stores. It's called Wiki Magic Muscles and that smells like this as well. It's got clove and I think that one has mint too if I'm not mistaken. So if you're familiar with those two products then you, this is along those lines. It's not too sweet and then it has that sort of fruity apple-y note underneath. You don't smell apples really so it's not like it's not like so white at all. Um, 
So now let's see what it looks like up close. Okay, here's what it looks like. It's uh, very green. And that's on the back of the bottle. And so now I'm going to show you what the consistency is like. It doesn't have any kind of shimmer or anything that I can see. So that was Demon in the Shower shower gel, and um, I would rate this a four and a half out of five. I took a half point off because it is so thin, um, and um, I'm not sure the original one that I demoed a couple weeks ago is this thin. That was the original one from years ago, and I thought that there was a silver sheen to it, but I, I guess I was wrong, and so it works really well together. Who knew? Mint and apples. I love that they changed the name from Demon in the Dark Shower Gel to Demon in the Shower. That's really cool. And so if you have any questions about Demon in the Shower Shower Gel, just let me know by commenting below and I'll try to answer as soon as I can. If you enjoy this video, please like this video by giving me a thumbs up down there. You can go to my blog at lushalot.com to find out more information about Demon in the Dark Shower Gel and other shower gels. And as always, thank you for watching and we'll talk to you on the next video.